Why do people set meetings over lunch? I like to give them the benefit of the doubt. Maybe they're so busy it's the only time they have. But it's pretty disrespectful. I am hungry. I'm about to start hiding hot dogs in my sleeves. I block my lunch on my calendar as a reoccurring meeting. That way if people try to schedule a meeting at noon, they see I'm already in one and pick a different time. If it absolutely has to be a lunch meeting, providing food for your captive audience is the minimum required courtesy and good food. None of that bargain delivery pizza bullshit. I once called someone out for scheduling a last minute lunch meeting and they replied, well your calendar was free. If you don't want to have meetings at noon then mark yourself as unavailable. So now I have a repeating calendar event called lunch so that meeting schedulers see that I'm busy. I rarely get invited to lunch meetings now and people usually check if it's okay to schedule over a conflict like that. Because people are assholes. Because it was the only time available and this is urgent. B.S. If I look at someone's calendar and they are busy all day with one small break around noon. I assume that's the only spare time they have to eat lunch and look for a different day. I hate this. Like others on this thread, I have recurring focus time on my calendar that is blocked out every day for lunch. It auto-rejects any meeting requests for that time. If people schedule a meeting then, I just don't go. A few years ago I worked in a team that had constant meetings maybe 6.5 hours a day average. But our lunches were somewhat sacred. Once someone higher up scheduled a meeting for the lunch hour and our director straight up scolded them about it in another meeting and told them to move it because she didn't expect any of us to work our lunch break. I never saw a meeting scheduled over lunch again. We had a new department head start recently over a different department. He kept wanting to do lunch and learn events. I nipped that in the bud quickly. I flat out told him that lunchtime is for the employees to rest and enjoy lunch. On top of that, if they are eating while trying to absorb new material, neither of those things are going to be done well. Not a peep about that again. Hot dogs up the sleeve are the answer. Just make sure you don't choke. A production supervisor did that with a safety meeting during the hourly employee's lunch. I told them all to call the labor department and leave an anonymous complaint. If you do give them your name they could be required to tell the company if they happen to ask. My workplace has people in different time zones. I just made a meeting for myself on my lunch hour and called it no meetings. I usually take 30 minutes break somewhere between 12h and 13h. If someone makes me work while I want my noon break I take 1h to 1h30 break. When she was pregnant my wife invented purse cheese. Patent pending. Not like pre-packed plastic wrapped kids to go shit. Nah. Bonnie got a block of cheese. A wooden cutting board. A knife. And Triscuits all in one ziplock. For like 4 minutes and then it was just purse cheese and that was a suitable snack while driving or in a meeting. And I mean she was hormonal and had a knife. So that's pretty much okay. She swore it was perfectly logical then. Didn't catch on. Not a purse cheese family anymore. Because I'm trying to get 10 people together across 4 to 5 different time zones. But it's limited and of course to be avoided if possible. Because they're trying to get free work out of you under the guise of a lunch and learn. My lunch is my time and I choose how I spend it. I don't want to feel like I have to eat all the time. My last job. My team set a rule about that if you request a meeting between 11.30 and 1.30. If we don't get an email asking for our lunch order none of us are showing up. ETA as another poster said. Fuck your cheap ass pizza. We're talking barbecue shawarma real food if anyone bothers me at lunch it's no longer an unpaid lunch so therefore i leave an hour earlier 
Eight-five exists because they stopped wanting to pay that hour. Don't give them the hour they stole. The trick is to not only block the time in your calendar, but when someone tries to book over it decline it and ask them to reschedule if they need you there. If they ask why, then tell them in order to be productive you require a break during the day. They can select another time in the day if they need to see you. I've not come across someone who is a big enough asshole to deny you lunch when you explain it. If there is someone, fuck them right off. Because they don't give a fuck. Because you let them. My job was bad about that. I set a daily meeting from 12 1 and if people schedule over it I don't go unless it's something really important. I've been to two lunch meetings since I started doing this. People will disrespect your time as much as you allow them to. Buy food or F off. I'm not talking about work when I'm stuck at work during my break. It sucks enough that by one hour break isn't mine I can't do laundry. Can't sleep. Can't go to the store unless it's right nearby. I either want to take a walk. Play a game. Watch my phone. Never work while not being paid. If I get an invite to a meeting at noon. Then my lunch is at 11 or I'm leaving at 4 p.m. They don't get my time like that. This is when you microwave some fish curry and rice and bring that to the meeting with you. Oh, it thought it was a brown bag meeting my bad but I have to eat now cause ma suga levels. When I was getting trained at my job the girl training me told me she input invoices and did computer work on her break and I laughed in her face and said that's hilarious you can scam yourself but that's my me time to eat food and decompress from the bullshit set up a standing appointment in your calendar between 12 and 2 if someone invites you respond with tentative that way you know what's going on and you can decide whether to go or not if you're an essential attendee they can schedule it outside of lunchtime sorted where i work some people pride themselves on being busy and either going to lots of meetings or booking their calendars with blocked off focus time. So there are two people on my team that look fully booked all day. Every day. That leaves no good option for scheduling meetings. Other than sometimes lunch meetings. Blame the people who live their lives in meetings. Not those who have to occasionally schedule a lunch one because of them. Because people accept their invites. X200B. I have lunchtime meetings every single day according to my calendar. I am simply never free at that time. Same as I have a meeting 7-9 every morning and 5-7 every evening. I block out 12-1MF on my calendar and decline any meetings that conflict. They can happily waste their lunch breaks. I will attend the meeting no problem. Then I will either take my lunch before or after the meeting. I used to have a boss that liked working lunches as he called them. Yeah I got to eat. And he paid. But my break was my only escape for me time while at work. And we never discussed anything that couldn't have been brought up in a regular meeting during working hours. It wasn't super often. But he'd always just spring it on me suddenly. So I never felt secure bringing my own lunch or making plans. This is why I like to schedule any routine meeting 1-100, 1-200. People are motivated to keep it short and sweet. So all can get to a deserved break. You. Can't. Skip. Lunch. I DK but they make it really easy for me to hit decline when they do. I do it so I can go to a fancy restaurant that I want to try and expense the meal. Our place has a specific rule against lunch meetings. Maybe you could look into that. 